Yeah, so we presented work on uh, the existence of um, multiple myeloma B cells and preplasma cells, and also on their role in myeloma relapse in patients. For the past 70 years, the focus in myeloma has been on eradicating plasma cells, and our work suggests that a, a change in that paradigm is, is needed and that the time has come to now start focusing on treating myeloma preplasma cells and B cells. So our work had uh, four lines to it. In the first part, uh, we demonstrate the existence of myeloma B cells and preplasma cells. Uh, we use, do this um, through a combination of uh, fish and immunofluorescence and demonstrate that these progenitor cells have all of the uh, chromosomal abnormalities present in myeloma plasma cells. In the second part of our work, we demonstrate that the different um, subpopulations can interconvert by differentiation or dedifferentiation. And we do this in in vitro models and animal models. In the third part, we uh, perform whole exome sequencing and we demonstrate that the uh, myeloma progenitor cells, the B cells and the preplasma cells, have the same um, single nucleotide variations, the same mutational profile as the myeloma uh, plasma cells. So we demonstrate that they have full malignant capacity. And in the fourth part of the work, we track these subpopulations in patients over time um, by looking at the uh, mutational profile of the cells at different time points. And that allows us to um, determine where the relapsing plasma cells um, come from in a patient. So uh, the conventional paradigm is that these would come from the plasma cells pre-treatment through linear evolution. Um, but we go on to demonstrate that, in fact, in all the cases that we looked at, the relapsing plasma cells derive from myeloma B cells or preplasma cells from progenitor populations. And those pro- populations do not respond to current uh, treatments, immunotherapies or myeloma drugs, perhaps a bit to high-dose melphalan. Uh, but these populations, um, we believe, are the reason that we're not curing myeloma with current treatment. So after 70 years, we think that uh, in addition to targeting myeloma plasma cells, the focus now needs to be on also targeting myeloma preplasma cells and B cells. Uh, and we hope that that one day will lead to a cure for myeloma.